side right here, right? And say, whoa. Whoa. Loud. Whoa. Connect with her. Whoa. And if you feel that she's going ahead of you, I want you to come in front here. I want you to use your thumb right here and go back. 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 Push her. Back. Back. Keep going. Back. Keep going. Back. She's licking. She's accepting you. Come on. you got to be stronger with it. Back. 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 Come, Come on, Maisie. Back. back. With your back. thumb, not your fist. Your thumb. That's right. Keep going. Keep going. So Simon, what's happening here right now is you're trying to collect yourself, you're trying to not use your shoulder, you're trying really hard to just use the new tool that I gave you. So it's causing her to also be imbalanced till your brain starts to focus. So you will, you will be able to see when you look at your video how it's more effective if you Take the tools, try your best to utilize them, and you will see how the horse will slowly come to understand what you want of her. Do you notice right now she's not listening, she's not balanced, but she is extracting, cleansing right now. And that is what she's doing. And yes, you're right. She's hearing her babies. That may also make it a little anxious for her to want to listen, but you're doing a great job. Great job.
so Simon, I just want to just remind you that this horse is by nature very afraid, very anxious. She's very sensitive and she lives in the spiritual realm where you live in. So did you see what she just did right there? That's her fear base. So she would be like a little girl who needs guidance. So the more you learn your guidance on how to cause her to trust you, the more you're going to see that she will walk more balanced, straight, more trusting. And you may have things that you brought in your heart today that she's picking up from as well. Otherwise, you're doing an incredible job on helping her not to be afraid. Good job, Simon. Don't forget to talk to her if you can. Simon, I also want you to see within this video at this moment how she was pacing according to your need. And you can evaluate what just happened right there. Okay, there are times that even though you're walking alongside someone who's giving you good advice, would you say that you may or may not react to that advice and then you were able to bring her back? Do you notice how you also gave her more restraint underneath her chin? So there's a reason for sometimes workers, helpers, parents, friends to also help us become restrained. That was very good. Craig, this is you one day. Um, not necessarily. If I may, if I may respectfully agree to disagree with you. The reason why this horse called Maisie is allowing, if I may use that term very loosely, allowing Simon to work with her is because she is Simon. Mm -hmm. She is Simon. She sees Simon. You see me, therefore I am, is very evident Oops, here. So Maisie comes across very calm. Rather, if you ask Simon about his true nature, how he can be explosive, that is Maisie. That is why a lot of people do not want to work with Maisie because Maisie has a tendency of exploding. A lot of people will not ride Maisie because Maisie has a tendency without notice to explode. So what you see here, Simon, is you have made a connection with a horse that understands you. how patient she is with you. Even though you were off with your pace, she balanced and slowed down for you and because she understands you. And that is the important thing of knowing 
that even with our workers or our friends, it's that knowing of when to balance. So what did she do right there? She was you. <laughs> no she went ahead of herself. But well, you caused her to be balanced again. Good job. Okay. Are we done? What would you like then for her to have her freedom? Sure. So what we do is we let her go. We hold on to here. Okay, we let her go and we back up right here. Back up because... Thank you, Muzi. And you say thank you. thank you. Good girl. Now because she's too close to us, we're going to say, Maisie, you are such a good girl. Back up. Come on, Maisie. <laughs> good girl. Back up. And then we're going to help her. Come on. She has a powerful hind end. Come on. Come on, girl. Woo! Woo! <laughs> Woo! What's up, Maisie? So now, would you like to bring her outside? Yeah, Maisie, here. Okay. Okay, stay away from her. Not that she will. Good job. Good job. <laughs> Good job. There you go. And always walk on one side when we leave them on your right, right there, left. 